And we actually had a chance to talk with a structural engineer who did some work on this complex in Surfside four years ago. Now, while that work was not related to this collapse, 10 Tampa Bay Shannon Close spoke with him about what he saw today and what that might mean for you. Safety is so important to Greg Batista that he created a company out of it. We specialize in existing building repairs. As a structural engineer, that brought him to Champlain Towers in 2017. We were at the building. As a matter of fact, when I saw the news this morning, I was like, wait a minute, that building looks familiar. And while that job had nothing to do with this morning's collapse, it piqued his interest. We were hired to do an inspection on some waterproofing and some planters that were on the actual deck. Looking out for structural damage is what he specializes in. I can say that this looks like, I reiterate the, the word looks like, that this was a structural collapse that happened and was the origin was on the bottom floors. They're still not sure what caused it. But as we watch all this terrifying video, he says there's a safety lesson for us all. People need to be aware. And if you see a crack on a building, if you see big spalling, if you see those kind of things, you know, you can make a phone call and have somebody check it out. And even though it's likely it may not be a big issue. There's another small but significant percentage that there's an underlying structural problem. This is something that is highly unusual, but it's possible that something like this happens. Seeing some of those AC units, even bedding, just laying off that building is kind of jarring. Now, that building was actually due for its 40-year inspection. It was built in 1981, and a Miami-Dade County ordinance requires a structural inspection after 40 years and then every 10 years thereafter. 